Hello, everybody. Welcome to today's devotion for September 7th. Today's devotion is titled Acts of Kindness, and the Bible reading is from Ruth chapter 2, verses 5 to 12. Then Boaz asked his foreman, Who is that young woman over there? Who does she belong to? And the foreman replied, She is the young woman from Moab who came back with Naomi. She asked me this morning if she could gather grain behind the harvesters. She's been hard at work ever since, except for a few minutes rest in the shelter. Boaz went over and said to Ruth, Listen, my daughter, stay right here with us when you gather grain. Don't go to any other fields. Stay right behind the young women working in my field. See which part of the field they are harvesting, and then follow them. I have warned the young men not to treat you roughly, and when you are thirsty, help yourself to the water they have drawn from the well. Ruth fell at his feet and thanked him warmly. What have I done to deserve such kindness? she asked. I am only a foreigner. Yes, I know, Boaz replied. But I also know about everything you have done for your mother-in-law since the death of your husband. I have heard how you left your father and mother and your own land to live here among complete strangers. May the Lord, the God of Israel, under whose wings you have come to take refuge, reward you fully for what you have done. Months after suffering a miscarriage, Valerie decided to have a garage sale. Gerald, a neighbor craftsman a few miles away, eagerly bought the baby crib she was selling. While there, his wife talked with Valerie and learned about her loss. After hearing of her situation on the, on the way home, Gerald decided to use the crib to craft a keepsake for Valerie. A week later, he tearfully presented her with a beautiful bench. There are good people out there, and here's proof, Valerie said. Like Valerie, Ruth and Naomi suffered great loss. Naomi's husband and two sons had died, and now she and her bereft daughter-in-law, Ruth, had no heirs and no one to provide for them. That's where Boaz stepped in. When Ruth went to a field to pick up leftover grain, Boaz, the owner, asked about her. When he learned who she was, he was kind to her. Amazed, Ruth asked, why have, I, why have I found such favor in your eyes? He replied, I've been told all about what you have done for your mother-in-law since the death of your husband. Boaz later married Ruth and provided for Naomi. Through their marriage, a forefather of David and of Jesus was born. As God used Gerald and Boaz to help transform the grief of another, he can work through us to show kindness and empathy to others in pain. When have you been given... Blah, blah, blah. When have you been the giver or recipient of an act of kindness? And what was the result? Thank you for joining me for today's devotion, and I hope you all have a wonderful day.